Intex Ardent Sarah Hubert, Religious Affairs Airman. So I realized that I needed something more in my life when I got to my first stateside assignment. Um, it just started ending up being just work, sleep, work, sleep. I worked on an off shift, so I didn't really see the daylight hour as much. And at that point, I kind of realized I needed something more in my life, something to recharge me better, because the sleep wasn't recharging me as much as it should be at that point. I started um, searching out just different things that other people I had seen were doing. So um, first came motorcycle riding. So I started getting into that, um, decided to sign up for the basic riders course, went through all the Air Force safety stuff and fell in love with it as I was going through those courses. And then a couple of years after that, um, I moved to a place where it was colder during the winter. So that's when I started to search for a couple of indoor activities and I just fell in love with kickboxing as soon as I tried it it kind of gave me that same sort of nervous excitement um, that motorcycle riding had been giving me. I would definitely say they're extremely important to my resiliency. They've kind of become ingrained in part of my life. When I don't have them, I definitely notice a shift in my paradigm. When I started implementing these hobbies, the biggest change was I started feeling more recharged throughout the day. I would become less irritable, um, Anything that happened through the day, I was like, it's okay, after this I'm going to go ride or I'm going to go hit the mat, get out there, train some more, go ahead and get ready for the next day, recharge, just recenter myself. There's a sense of clarity and a sense of accomplishment that I get from these activities that I don't get anywhere else. I've kind of set myself up so that I have or have access to these hobbies at all points. Like during the summer, I can ride my motorcycle. During the winter, I can do kickboxing. There has been a couple of stints where I haven't been able to do either, and I've definitely noticed myself um, getting out there trying to do something to fill the void of those activities. Um, and then normally, once I get right back to them, I'm extremely excited. These hobbies have definitely changed my perspective on resiliency because prior to actually having these, people would tell me, you need to go out, you need to be more resilient, you need to do more things to make you resilient. And that kind of left me with the question with, okay, I know I need to be resilient, but how do I be resilient? So these have actually made me realize that it fills each one of the pillars. I can either be social and kickboxing, or I can be secluded with my bike and just me on the road. No matter what way I'm feeling or what I need to do to recharge, both of them can fill some sort of void that I'm having that day.